Good morning, guys. Hey, Dharma Jane. I'm adjusting my crown for you. Uh, this is Stephen Howard and my dog Rio. Yucca's inside and staying warm. It's pretty cold this morning out in the desert, about 48 degrees. Sunrise. And uh, I'm out here by the Gene Roach Lake Bed. It's where my movie Breaking the Chain will be filmed, the motocross scene. Um, I've been on quite a spir spiritual adventure. It's been about, uh, oh, going on four years now. Uh, about four years ago, I stopped a ro robbery at the Target at Blue Diamond in Arville with my own gun. I protected my family, my friends, uh, the public, the security guards, the management, and everybody in the parking lot. Um, I did scare quite a few people. Um, I ended up firing my gun at a back tire. A uh, perpetrator was trying to pinch me between two cars. I went all the way through court trials. I went through a two-year uh, arbitration process and then I went to actual trial where I stood on the stand and told my story. Um, it was the bravest I had to be in my whole life, even rock climbing or motocross or anything because I was looking at 25 years to life in prison. Um, I was lucky enough that Oswaldo Fumo, Ozzy Fumo, uh, Dustin Marcello and Michael Maselli uh, I know those sound like mafia names, but they uh, they all protected me. Um, the state wanted to put me away, uh, saying that I was a gun wielding vigilante. But the fact of the matter is, is uh, I'm actually a hero. And uh, you know, I I wasn't really aware of of how much until the other day. I was stopped by the police and I was holding a sign out for gas. And uh, when I told the story to the police officer and then I was so respectful and uh, so honoring of police service that uh, she was like, well, I really appreciate your honesty and candor. And uh, I was being filmed by um, some guys that are uh, remote vloggers and they happen to pick up my video and um, I don't know, maybe that's the one that'll go viral. But um, my name's Stephen Howard. I'm an inspirational speaker here on YouTube. I try and take the negatives that life gives you and turn them into positives. I try and focus on the positive and uh, you know, let the negative kind of fall away because it usually does anyway. Uh, I've been living out in my car for, oh, it's about nine months this time, maybe more. And uh, I honestly feel like I'm, I'm ready for something else. Uh, I had a trailer in an old Suburban and I lived up in Montana on some acreage by the uh, Clinton, Montana, by the Clark Fork River. And I really love Montana. Uh, it's really cold up there right now, I guess. But um, I'm looking forward to maybe getting back there someday. Uh, however, my journey uh, began with the robbery. And then uh, there were quite a few other things that happened. I ended up divorced and losing custody of my child through the case. And... Um, I've been through a lot of pain, a pain that normal, like you normally shouldn't have to go through in life, but sometimes life will deliver an extra one, two punch. So, um, I'm basically out here this morning trying to tell my story, but, um, I think the, the gist of it all is that if, uh, if we take what we have and we appreciate what we have and we look at what we do possess our personal power um, then you haven't really lost anything you've actually gained something by the experience of the pain and everything that you went through 
uh, if that makes any sense. I'm still trying to recover, you know, when your life, when you lose everything and uh, your life takes a turn, um, it's not over. It's it's a new beginning. It, it means that there's room for a lot of new, a lot of new love, a lot of new things. I uh, got a new vehicle last month. Uh, thank you, Roger Howard, my father. Uh, he said it's the last thing he'll be able to do for me. Um, it was a big purchase, and I really, 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 really appreciate it. Um, you know, I'm, I'm going to be 49 years old in, uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow's December 10th, my birthday. So I'm going to be 49 years old. Uh, I feel like I'm about 28. I still feel like I could hop on a motocross bike and do 120 across the lake bed. Uh, I also do a lot of rock climbing out in Red Rock if you look at my other videos. Uh, I'm looking for uh, for sponsors. I'm looking for people to help sponsor the channel, help sponsor my endeavors, and turn my uh, passion, my love for people and healing uh, into um, my career or my, my destiny. So um, if anybody wants to help me with that, please reach out. Um, my name is Stephen Howard. It's uh, S-T-E-P-H-E-N. Stephen Howard 933 at gmail.com. Uh, telephone number is 406 215 6281. I'm here in Las Vegas currently. Um, as soon as I'm final with probation and pay my $2,000 fine, I am free to go. So uh, I would like to be a regional rep for CBD Company, 11 Western states. I'd like to get media content and things for different peoples for their advertisements and websites. Uh, I'm a model and an actor uh, as well as a psychic medium and uh, empathic healer. I, um, I heal people generally by kind of baptism of fire or baptism of pain. Um, I find uh, the core to their their issue, and then we expose it, and 